Hello. I've been playing around with the clean flight source code a little bit to try and um, get started on making a follow me kind of a feature. And what I've done at the moment is modify the return to home so that it doesn't quite go to home. It only goes to 10 meters away from home. Uh, that's one change I made. And for now, I'm hard coding two points that it's going to move between. So every 15 seconds, it's going to switch between going from the helipad, <laughs> very loosely named helipad, which is over there, and that corner of the fence over there. Every 15 seconds, it'll switch between them. The first time, it will just come to home. The first 15 seconds, it will return to normal home, which is going to be here. Uh, so let's see how that goes. Just step back a little. Alright, so I just put this about here. You can see it's facing away from me at the moment. And I hit return to home there. It'll turn around. So from this point, I'm not going to touch the controller at all. And it comes back to home, but it doesn't come all the way. Uh, it's come a little bit further than I wanted, but that's okay. So after 15 seconds, it's going to go over to the other location. And it will stop when it gets to 10 meters away from there. And then in another 15 seconds, or 15 seconds from when it changed to going to there, it will go still not doing anything so this is it's uh, it's basically the waypoints code that I'm just hard coding two two waypoints into to switch to switch between so I'll just go over to the uh, this point over here and see if we can Let's see if I can stand on the point that it's supposed to be going to. Oh, freaked me out then. I didn't see it for a second. Uh, so I think it's about here, roughly. So still not doing anything. And it's f roughly facing us which is the idea for a follow me cam. It's facing us quite well now. So this time it is about 10 meters away. But it's drifting a little bit still. So then after 15 seconds it goes back over that way. <laughs> when I turned around just before I couldn't see it below the horizon and I freaked out. I thought it had crashed but I could hear it flying still. So I was like, what's going on? Alright, so another 15 seconds there and it's turning around and it will come back over here. So the idea with this is that instead of just hard coding those two points I would be carrying a follow me tag that's telling that thing where my GP, current GPS location is of this. Well, well not, not this, but, you know, I'll be holding something. So that's, uh, it's working quite well so far.